everybody, my name is Sergeant Jellyfish, and welcome to today's video. As you can see by the title of this video, we got another reaction video for another FNAF trailer out right now. If you haven't already, go ahead and like the video because uh, it seems that a lot of you like to come by and stay for these reaction videos, but don't end up subbing and liking and commenting. So if you don't like the video, are you hearing me? I am going to find you and take what I want! Without further ado, yes, we are watching the Five Nights at Freddy's official trailer. Um, I don't know if what we watched beforehand was the teaser trailer, but you know, you know, it is what it is. We're just here to react to it and give our take on it. So if you guys haven't already, go ahead and check out the other video uh, that I made on this as well. Let's get started. You ready, Freddy? Vamos! All right, fence me right now. All right. Hi, this is Mike. I was just calling to see if that job that you offered was still available. Yes. The security guard. I will take anything. Whoa, wait, wait, wait. Okay, never mind. This okay. Was huge we'll we'll pause it. The kids. We'll pause it afterwards. Shut it down years we'll, uh, ago. The owner's we'll just not ready to let it go yet. I will work and you will sleep. I understand. Uh huh. Give me your hand. I like that. I like that. Megan was All a pretty have to do funny movie. Just keep your eyes Robots a little longer. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's, where fantasy and fun come to life. Okay. You must be a new security guard. Can I uh, help you, officer? Have you met them yet? Met who? Them. What? Oh my god! In the 80s, kids went missing. The police searched Freddy's top to bottom. Hello? They never found them. That's why the place shut down. There are ghost children possessing giant robots. Thanks for the heads up. Oh, this Technically, they're animatronics. Straight. Look at that, we have... What do they want? Okay. They want to make her like them. Bobby! The cupcake even getting it in? <laughs> oh, yeah. It's too late. <laughs> Bobby, go! <laughs> oh, we getting spring trap here? Where to? Yo! Let's get the weirdos. Let, let's go! He made it in, baby. Knew it. The rumors were true. The rumors were true. Y'all, oh my goodness. It's time for the re- Time to run that junk back. All right, from the beginning. Oh my goodness, my hands hurt from clapping so loud, bro. We made it, bro. Look at it. Look at homeboy. All right. Hi, this is Mike. I just so, okay, we got the, job the daughter. The Mike has a daughter here. So here's what I'm trying to figure out. Steve? Ragley? Nah, 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 nah. The rumors told us, all right, that he was going to be playing William Afton. See, in the first movie trailer that we got for the FNAF movie, we actually got a real good close-up of him just sitting like this, right? If you guys remember, we didn't see nothing but him sitting in just the background. Now we get like a clear visual of his desk and so we get his name tag and everything and that doesn't match up to William Afton. So my question is, or our question should be, who is Steve Raglan? Yes, the security guard. I will take anything. Look at that, Mike being this place desperate. Was huge in the 80s with the kids. Closed. They shut it down years ago. Probably, the yeah. owner's just not ready to let it go yet. Uh -huh. I will work and you will sleep. I understand. And what's this dynamic? Okay, 
something I really wanted to talk about. Uh huh. All you have to do is keep your eyes on the monitor. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's, where fantasy and fun. Yep, come to we life. saw that. Okay. You must be a new security guard. Can I uh, help you, officer? Have you met them yet? This must be Vanessa, because there is a Vanessa in this movie. And as far as we know, she gives this dude Mike a few tips on these animatronics, right? Like, why does she know the secrets of these animatronics, you know? And like, why is she, what is she, why is she here? What, what is she cooking? That. Met who? Them. Them. Look at that. Ah. Wait, let's go back on that. So, look at all of this, man. They got the masks and stuff. Uh, let's eat. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Abandoned and everything, man. That's crazy. I've always liked the way the FNAF um, pizzeria room looked, you know? In the 80s, kids went to Foxy school. looking clean. The police search Freddy's. Hold on. In the 80s. How much do you think Foxy's uh, pants cost? That's why the place shut down. <laughs> there are ghosts. Yeah, that sounded a little bit like the, the uh, spring trap jump scare. Thanks. It's too late. Oh, hold on. Let's see. Let's stop. <laughs> That's it. It's too late. Overall, these animatronic designs, so good. A viewer in the last video said that, I th I think he said that, um, or they said that the people that created these animatronics were from the creature shop. But I find that so insane because if you look at some of their creations, creature shop, he has such good stuff, bro. Look at that first look at Springtrap. Uh huh? Okay, I like that scene. Hold up. But first, you know, we, we saw... We saw, uh, what's his face? Oh, my. This is the probably the best replicas of, or just, like, you know, the best the costume designs for these animatronics ever. Look how Chica's, uh, her little bib thing, it, it looks dirty and, and musty, bro. But then again, you know, Chica always looked musty. Oh my goodness. Don't sleep on this. Don't sleep on this. Look at the eyes. This is Springtrap. Without a doubt, this is Springtrap. Look at how battered and just like withered the uh, the costume looks. And look at the eyes. Uh, you can't tell me that. Because I know that Spring Bonnie, like which was supposed to be like, you know, the unwithered version of the Springtrap suit. It ha I'm pretty sure it had like a different eye color, but this eye color only comes when we get William Afton Who gets murked by this freaking spring locks this see now? This is a classic case of just just FNAF timeline disaster and guess what for all the people out there that watch game theory I'm just saying I don't know wh where this is gonna come to this is either going to be a game theory or a film theory but just you wait because this movie is probably going to Make a whole bunch of questions come up. Let's continue. Oh my goodness. No way he gets stuck. Where to? <sighs> yes, sir. <laughs> Why do I always get the weirdos? This right here is crazy, man. Is this Golden Freddy, bro? Oh my goodness. So, two things to to just talk about here. One, we got the goat in here, bro. Come on now. Two, we got Abby right here who apparently got like a little bond with Freddy. This is like security breach, but FNAF 1 era type stuff. 
Uh, obviously, if you look at the posters, by the way, which I showed in the last video, the posters have Abby standing, I guess this is Abby standing next to, uh, Freddy. Whether this is Golden Freddy or not, I'm not gonna lie, it's looking a little bit dirty, and it's looking like more regular Freddy. But, you know, when it comes to color scheme and stuff, maybe we might just be, I don't know, tweaking them. This might actually be Golden Freddy. But hey, 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 I'm, I don't know, we don't have to see. Look at that, look at that. Man, story by Scott Cotton Cream. Let's we'll say, yep, yep. Okay, Emma, Seth, yes, sir. All right, fence me right now. Y'all. My goodness, bro, it's, it's so much. So, I heard, I heard it through the grapevine that Corey was gonna be in this, bro. Now, I, I didn't want to spoil myself, really. You know what I'm saying? I seen, I seen a few things. Primarily, I seen a black dude in a taxi. I was like, stop it, stop it. But then, it turned out to be true, man. So, you know what I'm saying, a round of applause. Let's give a round of applause for him. He actually made it on a movie screen, which is crazy, you know what I'm saying? Whenever YouTubers make it on like, uh, different types of media, like TV shows and movies, I always find that like so interesting. Because think about it, man. You started off recording yourself, and now you got you got people recording you for the sake of like a movie and stuff, you know? It's just, I don't know, it's just something cool. Now, as far as, as far as, uh, what's I'm gonna call it? This goes, man, I wonder how many YouTubers are actually gonna get in there, cause I'm pretty sure when it comes to movies, there might be a limit on how many guests and stuff you can put in there. So, cause I'm just saying, I like the addition of Corey being in a FNAF movie, in THE FNAF movie. But I also want people like Markiplier who basically launched this into the atmosphere. For me though, definitely the bigger the bigger runner-ups are uh, Corey and Markiplier for the people that just that just made FNAF go pew. And all in total though, you know, FNAF actually helped their careers a lot too, to be honest. I also feel like FNAF just like set a a new like standard for horror. Because horror can sometimes be like kind of analog, maybe old and stuff like that, and that's what FNAF did. I'm not saying that FNAF is an analog horror, but like, it's definitely a horror that takes place in the past. Before then, we were getting stuff like Amnesia and Slenderman. That was what was like rocking the world back then. Can you think about that? How, how, how far we've come with horror games, man? Scott made FNAF. FNAF is basically like a side-scrolling game. Like, if you think about the way FNAF was created, literally, it's... There, it's not 3D. I'm pretty sure it's actually 2D and you pan from side to side. But anyways, in total, I'm not gonna lie, this trailer was hype, man. It's got me just vibing with this movie. But yeah, that's about it. So without further ado, we're going to end the video. If you guys like the video, go ahead and like it. If you guys want to stick around for more, go ahead and sub. Follow my social because I be doing stuff on here sometimes, you know. Help a brother out. Without further ado, I am Sergeant Jellyfish and I will see you all later. Peace! Sergeant Jellyfish.